gather every year as we normally do, 10,000 strong downtown. Go to CannabisCulture.com to keep up to date with that. There's also some great news out of the eastern USA. I mean, we talk a lot about Washington and California changing their laws, but the eastern USA has a lot going on too. Most polls show that out of all the bills that are being introduced and discussed, there's a 70 to 80 percent support rate. That's phenomenal. So I got this list off of a website story, but they all direct basically to normal.org under the Take Action Center. So if you live in any of these states I'm going to read aloud, please go there, get involved. This is great to see. In Maine, you've got the medical marijuana dispensary implementation and a decriminalization bill. In New Hampshire, there's a medical marijuana bill. In Vermont, there's a medical marijuana bill and a decrim bill. In Connecticut, another medical marijuana bill and a decrim bill. Massachusetts, the same thing, medical marijuana bill and a tax and regulate bill. That's legalization, tax and regulate. Rhode Island, a medical marijuana implementation, decriminalization, and a tax and regulate bill. New York has a medical marijuana bill. New Jersey has medical marijuana. Maryland, medical marijuana and decrim. Delaware, medical marijuana. Virginia, decriminalization, although it says it stopped in committee, but at least something's been put underway. West Virginia, medical marijuana. Florida has medical marijuana. And North Carolina has decriminalization. That's phenomenal. I mean, that must be the entire East Coast. So change is happening. It's got to happen in the U.S. first because that's where the drug war is all funded from and pushed from. So come on, Americans, do get involved. Don't sit back and abandon yourselves and everybody else to the horrors of the drug war. You can make change happen, and this proves it. Thanks a lot, everyone, for tuning in. Go to freemark.ca, cannabisculture.com, and as always, work hard to free Mark Emery.